What's to you too, fam? It's your girl TK, and I'm out here car vlogging as usual. Stop playing. Y'all know my life is hella busy, so I kind of make videos on the go, period. And with that being noted, today we are going to be talking Jay-Z. I don't know if y'all have been looking at the news, but Dwell and Jay-Z is out here popping his calling real heavy. Real heavy, y'all. I don't know if y'all know, but Jay-Z came from Marcy Projects. And just to see him doing something so positive for himself, making music, having businesses, married to one of the most beautiful women in the music industry, and that is Miss Beyonce Knowles Carter, as well as working hard for everything they have, it's amazing to see, okay? It is absolutely amazing to see. Even if you don't agree with some of their work ethics, you'll still say, you know what? They went from being, you know, barely able to make it to being billionaires. Awesome. It's always awesome. Anyhow, last year around this time, Jay-Z was worth $1 billion. But now he's worth $2.5 billion, y'all. That's amazing. That's an amazing accomplishment for Jay-Z, especially with everything that's going on around him. It's like going down. No, well, I shouldn't say going down. It's just... A lot of stuff has been happening. Number uno, I don't know if you realize it, but he was talking about how Kanye West was a billionaire and Kanye West was starting to lose his brand deals. Then he talks about Miss Beyonce, but Beyonce, she can't even make sales. Although when it comes to her um, singing, she is definitely doing good in that area. But when it comes to selling to, you know, the market, people aren't really buying Beyonce's clothes you know, like they're buying her tickets, which is really surprising because we have to look at something. Beyonce knows Carter. She's a, a mega star, you know, a mega star. She's just not just starting out. So when we hear about her losing sales to places like Adidas, that's really concerning. That's worrisome. But to see that Jay-Z, who hasn't really been putting out a lot of, you know, albums, but he's doing singles and he's doing very well for himself, still making billions for himself, we have to give him his props. He deserves it. I'm sure you are thinking the same thing. And with that being noted, I want you guys to let me know what you guys think about Jay-Z with his extra billion. I do know one thing. Usually Jay-Z is online and he's popping his collar. He's doing a more relaxed look like, well, I should be saying lately. He's very relaxed. And this is my first time ever hearing him talking about his billions as of lately. And I'm not sure if he's doing it because, you know, Beyonce is going on tour. So, you know him saying he want to pop his collar just a tad bit, just to show off just a, just a little bit. And I don't see nothing wrong with it. If you got to show off, boo, you do your thing, honey. I am here for it. Y'all let me know what you guys think. You know, he's been looking real relaxed. He's letting his hair grow out. He's wearing a dread look. And, I, you know, I'm here for that as well. You know, if y'all like it, I love it. Although, I'm so used to him. Well, I'm so used to seeing him with a, you know, more of a clean cut look. But whatever works for him, like I said, works for him. Anyhow, y'all let me know what you guys are thinking about Mr. Jay-Z as well as the sales, honey. And how he's out here popping his collar. Although, a lot of his artists are just, in some areas, not doing so very well. With that being noted, guys, I want you guys to know that I have done many videos on Beyonce as well as Jay-Z. And if you're interested in what I have thought about their songs, um, their music, and anything that I see out here in these streets, you are more than welcome to look at my content, press play, as well as my community tab, because it's there for you, darling. It's absolutely there for you. Also, I want you guys to note that I do have Instagram. My Instagram handle is TK. K-N-O-W-L-E-S-01. Don't forget, guys, that I had um, deleted a lot of people off of my Instagram page. Actually, I deleted everybody. I ain't even gonna lie to you. I deleted everybody off of my Instagram page. I was like, you know what, Fudger? I'm fixed to start over, and I did exactly that. I'm starting over. So with that being noted, if you want to be my friend, child, just come on over, okay? It's okay. You can come, come, come on over. Let's be friends out here in these streets. And um, also, I want you guys to know 
that also I talk not only about Jay-Z, Beyonce, I talk about politics, laws, rules, regulations, because I was a former federal employee. So that's what you get from me if that is what you're interested in. So with that being noted, I want you guys to know, I hope you guys are having a wonderful day, evening or afternoon, as you can see. So peace, love, and happiness. Stay safe, stay blessed, and remember always, darling, Pay attention to these laws, rules, regulations, policies, as well as procedures, because you don't know how it might impact you. Bye, guys.